It's time now for Eye on Education. Well, if you want to get young students interested in learning about high tech and science, why not take it to their level, as in building their own video games, ninja style. Code Ninjas is the world's largest and fastest growing kids coding franchise, and it's gaining traction now in Indiana. In just one year, hundreds of Hoosier children have learned coding and STEM skills through Code Ninjas that could potentially lead them to careers in technology. Code Ninjas Greenwood owner and operator Josh Groh joins us now to explain how it all works. Josh, welcome. Hi, how are you, Gary? Uh, good. Uh, STEM, science, technology, engineering, and math. It's talked about all the time. It's everywhere you look. Uh, the need to really focus uh, on that. And I know Code Ninjas, uh, a big part of that is getting kids engaged, people engaged at a very young age. That's kind of central to the Code Ninjas model, right? Yeah, absolutely. So typically we look to see kids that are ages 7 to 14 beginning in our dojo. Uh, we have a platform for any of the kids depending on age. So they can start out with our fundamentals or go straight straight into our CREATE program. And as you look at it, I talked about bringing it to their level, kind of video games, is, is, how, is that part of the learning process? Absolutely, I would have loved the opportunity when I was a kid to be able to create video games. That's all I ever wanted to do, never had that opportunity. So I love that I'm able to offer that to kids through this game development platform. Uh, we teach multiple different languages, including JavaScript, C Sharp, and Lua, and there are a ton of different camp opportunities in the summer as well. Yeah, why is it so important uh, when you're talking about uh, tech technology and coding to engage uh, uh, young people at a, at a young age, to really start early. Yeah, of course. So it teaches kids resilience. It teaches them critical thinking. It helps with their logic and reasoning. I mean, there is pretty much no end to the benefits to learning STEM at an early age. Yeah, talk about the experience, if you will. As you mentioned, uh, you, you're dealing with uh, kids 7 to 14. So if I'm a 7-year-old, I, I come there. What's what's the experience like? And is it a continuum? Is it a continuum? type process that would continue on uh, maybe for several years. Yeah, of course. So the standard program you can see uh, from start to graduation is about two and a half years on average. We've only been open for a year, so we don't have that mm -hmm. completion yet. But uh, when the kids come in, they will start with our fundamentals program if they're on the younger age, which teaches Scratch. Uh, it's a program that's offered through MIT. It's drag and drop code editing. So it's a very cool way for kids to learn the program without having to know the actual coding aspect. And then they'll move on to JavaScript from um, our first to fourth belt, Lua in the fifth belt, and then the final belts will use Unity 3D and C Sharp. Mm -hmm. So very tech uh, tech intensive. Is this starting at a young age? I assume there's the possibility that this could spark a technology career down the road. I mean, who knows where things go? But you start early like that, that could could engage that uh, and start that process as well. Yeah, absolutely. We have some kids. Uh, one of our kids, she's awesome. She came in wanting to uh, be part of NASA. Another one wants to own. His his own software company. These are, we're talking like seven to 10 year olds. These kids are amazing. Yeah, we mentioned Code Ninjas is a franchise operation. Your uh, operation in Greenwood, there's also Carmel, Fishers, Northwest Indiana and Crown Point, West Lafayette. Do you sense with this push to get, you know, to fill that STEM pipeline, if you will, that this model and others like it are gonna be important to making that happen? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, if there is one thing that you can say, it's that kids like video games. So if you wanna combine them in with the STEM side, put video games in front of them, teach them how to make them. It's going to make that screen time awesome. It's going to make them have a good time, and they're going to want to come back. All right. Code Ninjas, uh, Josh Groves, the owner and operator of the Greenwood location. Coming up on a year, 250 kids uh, so far. STEM, obviously very important. Josh, thanks for joining us. Yeah, thank you, Gary. All right.